The school wanted to work with somebody who did costume, um, that was why I was paired with the school, and uh, they told me that they wanted to use the Victorian era as their start point, and obviously with the project on the line would be the whole kind of um, association with the train line and the history of the train line and the kind of um, the fact that it had socially and economically enabling people to come down from London. We looked at Victorian costume, uh, we looked at uh, historical train reference, we looked at kind of uh, the actual train line itself. Uh, we, we used a little bit of artistic license um, in using kind of old tourist posters ranging from the 20s to the mid 60s just because they had such beautiful colours in them. And we also looked a lot at uh, modern fashion designers who reference historical costume but then kind of bring it up to date with a very modern twist particularly we looked at somebody like Alexander McQueen and um, the, the loveliness about that was his, he uses a lot of shells and natural things in his work and the children really grabbed onto that and really loved the fact that you know we live in Leon Sea and we're in Essex and you know the fact that they could use shells in their costume they kind of never really thought about that. We've done loads of exploration in our workshops about using all different kinds of materials. They've been working on their own designs and working on their own projects and we've been looking together as a group. All the designs that they've done, I've kind of gone through and, and kind of cherry-picked, really, the really lovely, juicy bits and ideas and had a little vote about what they thought would be really good if we could include in the piece. And then I did a final design, so we're all working towards one piece. My favourite bits has probably been doing the drawing and designing and doing painting with the, on the shelves and spray painting. And we've been working on a train line backbone for the back of the dress. That's been made out of um, like a giant coil of thick wire and we've wrapped wire around it so it's like a train track. I think it's incredibly important for, for kids to be able to work with kind of uh, visiting artists and working on projects like this at such a young age because it just opens up a world of possibilities and it's, and it's new and it's fresh. And I've done all of it by myself. You did, didn't you? And you did no help. I think the thing that has really come out is a lovely kind of natural childish wonderment for, uh, associated with a what we could we can do exactly what we want kind of thing and that and that is a really beautiful thing I think there's a fascination kind of around design and creation and imagination and they've really uh, engaged with that and that you know some of the ideas they've come up with have been truly astounding and really inspired you know I'd be really chuffed if I'd come up with them <laughs> <laughs>